Hello and welcome to episode 13 of my Ancestors tutorial Let's Play series. This episode will be on making horsetail paste, having babies, getting more neurons and getting more spontaneous mutations, all the good stuff um, on the road to power before we can start exploring and expanding. We're doing the evolving side. We have been since episode 2. Right, horsetail paste. So I'm going to need a grinder and I'm going to need a pile of um, horsetail leaves. So let's do the leaves first. Now, thankfully with this, I should be able to get clan members to help me. Isn't that good? Um, right, I think I've already picked one. So let's... Uh, I need to drop it actually. Because what I need to do is get them to, in fact, I need one on the ground, yes. I'm engaging brain this time, it's much better when I do that, things tend to work better. Because what I need, of course, like I've shown, is I need one on the ground to start with. There we go, so there's my one that I can get them to dump them all on. So pick, mimic. Right, you sometimes have to give them all time to come over and do it. Now I'm going to switch hands and mimic. Notice they've switched their hands. Now we're all going to alter and mimic. Oh, all right, they aren't able to do that yet. They will do it at some point. They're just not ready. What can I say? We'll get there. Uh, for now I need to drop that on the pile and I want to get them to now drop the ones they've just picked uh, which I've already got a secondary pile here so drop mimic oh I bet they've got it in the wrong hand yeah they've got it in their left hands for altering so let's switch it back to the right hand Oops, mimic Now add to pile, mimic. There we go. Got there in the end. Does take time with me especially. Right now I need to get them. Uh, the best way to get them away, I think, is just to end the expedition. Hopefully that way they wander away. And now I need to get busy. Oh, I've got two piles of these now, so let's do that. Let's yeah, it's a shame I couldn't have got them to do these for me, but I need the ability. I need to further develop. I, I need the neuron, which will allow that. Right, that would be enough. Let's make some horsetail paste. Right, for that I'll need a granite grinder. And as luck would have it, there's a pile of granite here. So I'm going to pile these all up. Because I like rocks for my fighting weapons. And they've respawned. They don't respawn, obviously, if you don't pick them up there'll be no room for the new spawn so by picking these up when I pass the generation there'll be two piles of granite rocks again just like with the coconuts and the horse tail and the cat pick it up before you pass the generation and then you'll have loads of resources Right, let's make a grinder. Right, 
We get an ability, by the way, that will shorten the amount of hits that will take tremendously. You'll see, it gets really cool. Right, so now we need a horsetail leaf. Switch it to my other hand, and now we get grinding. There we go, discovered new alteration grinding. A granite grinder can modify horsetail leaves. So I need to switch that to this hand and now inspect it. New tool discovery, horsetail paste. There we go. And as you can see, you can apply it just like the horsetail leaf. And what does it do? Well, let me make a few and then I'll show you. Oh, look at that, leading tool user rocks. Use the granite grinder as a tool at least twice completed. So that's my first feat that I've got. So I can now evolve. Yeah, let me just make a few. Oh, no, 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 no. What he's gonna do is he's gonna throw it. I didn't switch, I did and I didn't do something right, that happens occasionally. So, to cancel that, no, I didn't do it right. You can cancel when you start to throw by accident. I've thrown my flipping grinder, and now I don't know where the flipping heck it's flipping landed under a flipping bed. Oh, all right, you know what, let's just eat one and show you what it does. I'll just make another grinder. So, let's apply it, and then you can see what buff I get and it will be for the longest duration longer than horsetail um, leaves so apply it and look at that full a full box because um, I don't know if you noticed it's been starting near the bottom when I used the horsetail leaf when I applied the horsetail leaf it was just a little bit at the bottom when you do the paste it's the full bar you get the full box so it will slowly drain downwards as the buff wears off and that protects me against bleeding damage so saber tooths and panthers and other creatures animals which do bleed damage now I've got protection against them or if they do bleed me I can cure myself really quickly let's make another bleeding grinder I can't believe I threw that. I do it though quite a bit, you know. Why is it saying apply? Did I pick up another one by mistake? Oh, I don't think I used the whole thing. I'm sure I did. Anyway, let's do another grinder. There we go, another grinder. Hopefully I won't throw this one away. All ah, right, so that's what I need. That's better, back on track. Does help if you look at your hands when you're doing it, because then you can see and not throw by mistake like I did. grinder for a minute. I've got to, to do some more horsetail leaves. Mm -hmm. 
Well, I'll do them when I finish recording. The thing is, though, I like showing when I get new neurons, and I, I, you know, there's a chance while doing that I might get a new neuron. So, a bit of a dilemma that whether I actually show the process of the crafting and getting the new neurons, or whether I just do it off camera and get the neurons, which I've been doing. Uh, I don't know. Um, I can't even say leave a comment to let me know which to do because I'm recording the first 20 episodes of Ancestors back to back well I say back to back over a couple of days I'm recording the first 20 episodes so when you're watching this I'd have already have done up, up to episode 20 um, right okay so let's see we've got one spontaneous mutation what do I need to do have I got time to do more babies and try for more or is that at the adult stage let's have a look oh so it's at the baby stage that's all right then so I've got time to do have more babies right good let's see if I can get any more be nice to get another neuron um, yeah look Let's try walking out here. Right, and let's first use intelligence. There you go, that's what I'm talking about, intelligence. It's growing though, it's not matured, so I've not got it yet. But even so, I like seeing growing neurons. There is hope for my brain yet. We don't touch them diamonds, we don't touch them, they're going to be feats. Uh, all right, let's try my senses. Not that I've got any. With some coconuts. But I'm not going down there after them because there'll be a saber tooth. And it's not that I'm afraid of the saber tooth. I don't want to waste the feats of dodging and fighting, so I'd have to let him eat me. And we've already seen, we've already em ended an episode with a saber tooth eating me. Let's try hearing. Oh, was that something? No? No. I'd have to be out in the jungle. Then you'd be hearing stuff all around me. The only things we're going to hear is my clan. And I don't think it'll give me a neuron for that for listening to my own clan, that's to be wild animal. Oh no, it will, look, oh cool. I'll have to remember that. So yeah, using the senses on my own clan. And it's matured. Very nice, very nice. Now don't you go getting in my way. I like the way you can just walk through them as well. Usually games, when it has NPCs, they get in your way. Um, this really is an exceptional game. Right, so I've got a matured neuron, which is very good, because if I initiate that now... And in fact, if I grow it, or put the energy into it, there we go. The range for, de for detection of sound sources increased. Cool. Okay, time for more babies. So I think I can have two more babies before it gets dark. They're coupled.
decoupled. Oh, I'm going to have fun and games trying to find them. They're stubbornly sat, un sat underneath a coconut tree or something somewhere. Oh, there's one I can see sat in the distance. Let's go over to them. Or is it a baby? Uh, if right, okay, let's try sleeping because it is getting dark. Oh, first end the expedition and then sleep. Sleep through the cold. Now let's see if I can find a missing couple. I think they're an elder, yeah. Let's try calling it. You see, you can see that all of the clan members have a link to me except for two. They wandered off somewhere. So I need to try to get them back into the settlement. And usually the best way actually to bring them back is drinking because they do like water. If not, I'll try eating. It might be they're stuck at the other settlement, but they will walk all the way over it. Eh? Oh yeah. They will walk the distance, and then the trick is when they've walked all the distance over here, before they head back, you do another clan call. It's a nuisance that uh, I only needed the female. If the male wasn't here, it wouldn't matter because I could have used an elder male. But I need the female in order to breed. And I don't want to pass a generation without them here because I believe I'll lose them. I can get her back, a, a new female back though. Obviously the game would put one randomly in the game for me if I lose my third female. But they're just not coming over here. This does happen very rarely. Could be because I didn't have enough beds here. So they stayed in the last settlement. That's probably why they're not here. 
Oh no, I've, no. Wait a minute, did I get one of them? Yeah, I did. Now, was it the female? Let's have a look. Adult male, no. He's an elder. No. No. Well, I can see that one of them is here. Yeah, so and it's, they're following me, but I can't see them. You can, you know that they're following me because you can see the lines in the supplement circle. They're all connected. Two, four, six, eight. I'm looking for the ninth one. Where is the ninth one? They might be, they get stuck on top of rocks, believe it or not, sometimes. Oh, I didn't want you all to do that, I'm just trying to get the bleeding last aid bit. That's handy, they've all got one, so eat. And that'll give them cold protection. Maybe that'll get them the ones that are missing here. The fact that if they don't eat, they're going to get bleeding cold. Who's this over here? No. Yeah, so I just can't get them back. Actually, I must make uh, some cat paste soon. Maybe that'll be the next episode. If I can ever get my apes back to here, where they should be. Right, I'm going to pause the video until I can get them all back here. Because you can be sure, as soon as I stop recording, they'll be back. So, back in a sec. Well, I did manage to get one of the, the male back here, but the female is just adamantly refusing to come back. So, do you know what? We're just gonna have to move on a generation without them. And I'll just have to find another female, but then that will be another feat, getting that female. So that's okay. I did get a new neuron. So, let's end the expedition, lay down, and initiate it. The new neuron I got was this one um, for settlement. So we'll grab that and I believe I've got the four babies. Oh no I need I can do yeah I've got the four babies so now I need to jump a generation and like I said I just have to ignore the fact that I've lost the other female you can get a female back. Uh, right, let's reinforce. Oh, I need the one to do. Pre 
preventive medication. Yeah, that's gone really well getting them. Right, let's have more babies. female and adult male oh he's family related uh, so what we'll do we'll switch to that female and do him that way there we go. Yeah, so as you can see, that female is officially lost. Till I can get another one. Oh, there we go, another spontaneous mutation. Cool. Senses. Right, now I need to find the other couple. Yeah, if you lose a female, like I say, like I've done, it is not a problem. Um, we'll be without a third female for a little while, but eventually, when I evolve to a new supplement, we'll see somewhere out there a new hominid in the trees or on the ground and then I can get them to join the clan um, and that will be another feat so oh look growing your own intelligence I keep trying to grow my intelligence a lot of good it does me try and find this other. the females seem to be the problems the males seem to follow orders okay it's the females right she's mated already that's her mate where's the other leading female it'd be so nice when I get the ability that they auto couple and then I don't have to keep running around looking looking for them There she is. I'm just going to eat it this time. Just going to eat it. Oh, there's the timer. Right, just want to have a couple more babies and then I'll end the episode because I want to see if I can get another spontaneous mutation. 
Notice I leave out the word genetic, it's just too much of a mouthful to keep saying over and over, so now I just call it spontaneous mutation. Does the trick. No, didn't get one with that one. And didn't get one with that one. Right, that's that all done. So if we have a look, I've got to make that one reach adult. This one is an adult, so pass a generation, do that in the next episode. And I need to energize this neuron for sleep recovery. Yeah, so we'll do that in the next episode. Wherever you are in the world, God bless you and keep you safe. Thank you for watching and have a fantastic day. Goodbye.